my name is Mermaid Kate. I feel so dumb doing this, but I ordered um, a mermaid tail off of Etsy, and nobody has ordered the same tail and posted a YouTube video of it, so I might do that. Not sure yet. Um, I ordered, I, I have one mermaid tail. I have a Fin Fun mermaid tail, and so I want to compare them. I want to see whether or not this tail is good, because I bought it for $68, which is the cheapest tail I will ever buy. Um, and the communication was a little bit shady, so I just curious to see how this goes, because originally it said $38, and then I messaged the sale seller, and she said um, it was kind of shady communication. She was she didn't quite tell me what all was included at first, and originally the monofin was not listed, and so she actually had to go and include the monofin in the in the price in the options of whether to just buy the tail skin and or the monofin or just the monofin i don't know uh, but it took about a month to get here it looked really pretty and i figured it would be a fun gamble but maybe not so fun if this doesn't work so i'm gonna open this and see what this tail skin looks like maybe i will post this maybe i won't but we'll see i'm totally new to the world of youtube so please forgive me um, we'll see how this looks. I am so nervous. I do not want to be disappointed. I'm just hoping it looks nice. I hope that worst case scenario, I can use my Fin Fun monofin to swim in this because this is, this is what I got. I don't know if a monofin is in this and I know that I bought both. So maybe that's in a different package that isn't here yet. I really have no idea and I'm so nervous. This is so nerve wracking. Definitely after this, I hope to either get a Mer Taylor Fantasy Fit 1 and or 3. The 1 is more attainable right now. The Fantasy Fit 1 is more attainable. It's cheaper. And supposedly it's really fast. So I hope to get that for Christmas. If I want to get a Fantasy Fit 3, then my husband thinks I should make a tail to go with the monofin for the three but hopefully this is a good tail and I can wear this this summer besides my fin fun I love my fin fun just it doesn't hold to my feet very well you know I'm pretty sure everybody else who has one knows what I'm talking about it doesn't um stick to my feet okay. maybe but this tail looked so pretty online so kudos to whoever designed it. Super pretty. I'm just hoping that it works. Let's see. Let's put this down. Okay. I'm actually really excited to look at this. Okay. Oh, the monofin is inside it. Ooh, okay, hang on. So, well, let's see. Here is the top. Okay. Put that. So it looks super pretty because it looks kind of like a like a butterfly. Um, I can't fold it out all the way. Ah, there we go. So theor hopefully, <laughs> theoretically, it will. This will fold out. But we'll see. Oh, I can't even. Is there a zipper? How do I get the monofin out? Or is it just like that? <laughs> what? What is going on? Okay, I'm just gonna roll it up. I hope I have enough storage for this video. Hope that I can post it and help somebody else. Cause I know that with Etsy, I was definitely, um, I lost my bracelet. Um, with Etsy, um, sometimes you're like, is this a good deal? Is it not? Um, I know that the silicone tails sold on Etsy are generally pretty good. I've heard of the Genesis tails. They look good. They're only about like a thousand which sounds great for a silicone tail. Um, so maybe that's a good option, but that thousand dollars is really expensive for me right now. Okay, I can't even, oh my gosh, is there a way I'm supposed to be able to get this out? I don't think so. It looks like they just put the mono, oh, 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 it's, this bins. So I guess that they just kind of slipped it through the top, but I'm struggling to like, 
read this. This is a struggle. Okay, okay, okay. The monofin is inside it. It's really nice that they installed that because I always struggled with this. What the heck? I don't even know if I can fit my feet in this. I hope that this like stretches more in the water. Um, let's do this, I guess. Oh, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. What is that? Are those the seams? Oh, those are the seams, okay. Try not to stretch out this tail already. Let's see. Okay, okay, okay. Which way are the feet? Okay, it's upside down. Okay, super close. I was so close. I'm just so nervous. Oh, 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 wait, there is a zipper. Hold on, there is a zipper. That is fantastic. <laughs> or fantastic, as I've heard people say. Okay, so there is a monofin. It's very odd. Oh, it's like clear. It's cl oh, it's it's attached to it so that it looks like this. There's plastic so that it totally forms to the tail. It goes down to here. I smell the plastic, um, which is fine. <laughs> um, okay, so it does have this sort of monofin. I don't quite know how it fits. I'm curious. I hope that it works. It if it works and if it fits to my feet, then I will be excited. I'm just hoping that it swims. Otherwise, I think that my fin fun will fit in here. Um, there was a video where Mermaid Zelda and Nerd May Faith, they tried on different um, monofins with different tails. Um, or they tried on different tail skins with different monofins. I guess that's the same thing. Um, but that was interesting. Oh, oh no. This is a struggle. Um, I have to loosen it. This kind of feels like cheap plastic, so I'm kind of worried. But I think, oh, and I took off the strap completely. But theoretically, my fin fun could fit in this. So that is good to know. So far, it doesn't feel terrible. I'm just struggling with the straps. I totally took off the actual strap. Oh man, I can no longer see. Okay, um, I took this off. I am totally struggling. I might have to get somebody to help me with this, but I'm the only one home. This is a thing for later, I guess. I was really surprised that the that the option to also buy the monofin wasn't included originally. It had to be put in there after I asked about it. But there were, like, supposedly other people had bought this. And so I was like, okay. A <laughs> little, little strange. And I think there was a, there was only one review that showed up after I bought it, bought this a month ago. And it was like some guy saying that it got here really fast and I was like okay mine did not but then again this came from Australia so let's see okay okay maybe I can fit both of my feet in here okay granted I did not put my feet through the uh, <laughs> through the actual tap tail okay this doesn't feel terrible actually I think this could be fine just maybe this time I should actually try and put my legs through because if I can't put my legs through, that is a different problem. Um, but it's good to know that there's a zipper so that I could put my tail, my fin, in it. Okay, I'm gonna close up the zipper. Hopefully I'm not boring whoever ends up watching this. I'm doing my best, never done this before. The tail is so pretty. I would love to learn how to print a tail, especially if it meant that I could buy the Fantasy Fin 3 and then make my own tail according to however I wish. Okay, let's see. I don't even know. Don't even know if this could work. Maybe my legs aren't meant to fit through there. Just as long as I can get the strap around my heel. Okay, let's see. The struggle. Okay, okay, maybe, maybe. Okay, I have one strap on my foot. I had ordered a large. It's, hopefully this stretches out if it's too small. I know that fabric will stretch 
in water. So hopefully that is what I end up needing to do. The plastic is a little bit bent because they put it all in a bag instead of a box. But hopefully I can find a way to flatten that out too, hopefully in the water. There's a lot of hopefuls in this equation. Let's see, okay, I'm getting close. <laughs> this is a struggle. Next time I'm buying more legit teal elephants. I can't even put this on. Maybe, maybe, okay, this is getting better. This is looking better. Glad it were tight. Um, okay, let's see, hang on, let me stand up. <laughs> Starts that hurts. Okay, that was hurting my feet for a second. Okay, okay. Let's see. I'm really close. I'm so close. And it definitely feels like it will stretch. It's the same kind of neoprene type deal. I like the fluke. If it could get like flattened out. And it looks really pretty. It's actually similar to mine. It's got some more teal and green in it. It goes to here. Okay, it goes to like right here, which is comfortable for me. I'm not the type of mermaid to like just wear a bikini top, so that's not a problem. Okay, so it feels like it fits fine. Move my hair back here. Okay, so let me show this. Without falling over, I'm not in a chair. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Look, I don't know if you can see that, but it's terribly bent. <laughs> um, but that I think is okay. Theoretically, I could put something um, on this monofin because the plastic kind of digs into my feet just a little bit. But at least it fits. Like the monofin fits. The tail fits so that's really good that's really nice I need to find a way to iron out this plastic but I think other than that this could work um, maybe I'll post a swimming video if I ever get the chance so far I don't really know of a lot of places that will let mermaids swim around in their tails because UNT doesn't let me practice in just a lane um, even though the fin fun tail is the safest mermaid tail ever. Um, but yeah, so hopefully this isn't too long. Hopefully this isn't boring. Um, I was thinking about posting this to YouTube just so that people could see what an Etsy fabric tail um, ended up looking like and being. And I will see if I can fix this um, or maybe it will just fix itself when I try it in water. Um, we will see. We will see and I will do some research. Oh, actually it looks a little bit better. Hang on, hang on. If I smooth this out, maybe it'll do that. Mm -hmm. um, I'll show you what this looks like. If I hold this, okay, let's do this. Down, like that. That's what this looks like. It's just a little bit bent. <laughs> but yeah, so that's what that looks like. Hopefully this wasn't terrible. I'll put this sideways again. Um, hopefully this wasn't too much. Um, well, this didn't cost a lot. This did not cost too much. Um, just it would cost a lot if um, this doesn't work at all. Um, hopefully worst case scenario, I have to put um, fabric or something around the, um, the opening where my feet go in. Cause when I flex my feet, it kind of digs into my skin, but I think I can fix that. So I don't know how much I recommend this tail yet because I need to swim in it and see how it swims first. But we'll see. Um, thank you Etsy for eventually um, getting this to me. <laughs> um, anyway, so I wish you guys luck. I, if there are any mermaids watching, I wish you guys luck. I recommend just going for Mer Taylor, Fin Fun. Um, there are other sellers but know that this is totally a game of you get what you pay for. Um, for fit, for um, Mer Taylor, their tails are 100% worth it. I don't have one yet, but like silicone monofins, like how can you go wrong? Um, and their, their tail skins are so beautiful. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, so I don't know. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Um, 
stay tuned, I guess. But be safe, mermaids. <laughs>